Welcome to Hydropower, a vital source of renewable energy harnessing the power of water to generate electricity. Today, we delve into the intricacies of a critical aspect of dam operations, the spillway gates. These gates play a crucial role during high flow seasons, releasing excessive discharge to maintain the integrity of the dam. However, with every action, there are consequences. During periods of high flow, the spillway gates are open to release surplus water, preventing potential overflows that could lead to disastrous consequences downstream. This process ensures the safety of the dam and the surrounding areas. However, the opening and closing of these spillway gates are not without impact. The concrete structure downstream of the gates, known as the sill, experiences significant damage, primarily due to two phenomena, cavitation and abrasion. Cavitation occurs when water flow creates low pressure zones near the spillway gates. As water rushes through, it causes the pressure to drop, leading to the formation of vapor-filled bubbles. When these bubbles collapse upon reaching higher pressure areas, they release energy in the form of shock waves. The repetitive collapse of these bubbles leads to the formation of small, powerful shockwaves that impact the concrete surface. Over time, this process results in the deterioration of the concrete, leading to pitting and surface irregularities. The repetitive collapse of these bubbles leads to the formation of small, powerful shockwaves that impact the concrete surface. Over time, this process results in the deterioration of the concrete, leading to pitting and surface irregularities. Abrasion, on the other hand, is caused by the sheer force of water carrying abrasive particles. As the spillway gates are opened and closed, the high-velocity water carries sediments and debris that collide with the concrete surface downstream. This continuous bombardment of particles leads to the wearing down of the concrete, akin to the effects of sandpaper on a surface. The result is a gradual erosion of the concrete structure, compromising its strength and durability. The combined effects of cavitation and abrasion manifest in the real-world consequences we observe in the damaged concrete downstream of spillway gates. The once sturdy structure succumbs to the relentless forces of water, requiring constant inspection and maintenance. To address these challenges, engineers employ various mitigation strategies. These include reinforcing the concrete with materials resistant to cavitation and abrasion, implementing regular maintenance schedules, and monitoring the spillway gates for signs of wear and tear. As we continue to harness the power of water to generate clean energy, it is crucial to understand the intricate processes that govern dam operations. By studying phenomena like cavitation and abrasion, Engineers can develop innovative solutions to ensure the longevity and safety of our hydropower infrastructure. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the world of hydropower dam spillways. As we look to the future, let's continue to balance progress with responsible environmental stewardship.